Chapter 13. Thomas Jones, Captain Cox, the Garrett sons, and many more were seized and taken to prison. Curiously, within weeks, Stanton freed them all. He put on trial only eight defendants. Mary Surratt, Lewis Powell, David Harold, George Azeroth, Samuel Arnold, Michael O'Loughlin, Edmund Spangler, and Samuel Mudd. Not one person who helped Booth and Harold during their escape except Dr. Mudd was punished. They returned to their homes and families and for years to come whispered secret tales of their deeds during the great manhunt. Another hunt, the one for reward money, began before Booth's corpse had even cooled. With Booth dead and his chief accomplices under arrest awaiting trial, it was time to cash in. Hundreds of manhunters rushed to claim a portion of the $100,000 reward offered by the War Department. Tipsters with the slightest connection to the 12-day search for Lincoln's killer tried to get their piece of the reward. More than a year after the manhunt ended, the government finally paid out the rewards. Congress paid Conger $15,000, Doherty $5,250, Lafayette Baker $3,750, Luther Baker $3,000, Boston Corbett, along with every non-commissioned officer at the barn, received $1,653. Colonel Wells and other interrogators received $500 to $1,000 each for their roles in the hunt. Nine men received smaller rewards for their part in the capture of George, George Azeroth, 10 for their roles in the arrest of Lewis Powell. Richard Garrett made a claim against the U.S. government for compensation for the value of his property, including the burned barn and the corn and hay consumed by the cavalry horses. The government considered his claim but refused to pay him a cent. After all, he had been disloyal to the Union. Boston Corbett was never punished for shooting Booth. He had violated no orders and no one could prove his motive was anything other than protecting his men. He enjoyed fame, both fame and notoriety for a brief time, then went mad and disappeared. So here are some pictures. This is David Harold. This is George Azeroth. Um, this is Samuel Arnold, sorry, and Michael O'Loughlin. Hey, Mama. Stop. This is, oh shoot, sorry, Edmund Spangler. Here's another memorial to the president. And then this is a montage of Lewis Powell. Apparently they liked to take his picture. And so he is photographed here. This almost looks like he's going in a magazine. And then these are all pictures of him as well. And that's the end of chapter 13.